that's why I don't buy lead weights, or I try not to. Ah uh, yes, West Marine. It's like candy land for me. I just picked up some fat daddy hooks for deep dropping. Got a planer for trolling tomorrow. Some big ol' swivels and then just a ton of hooks. Whoa. Also picked up uh, some lead weight. Darren's coming in like four hours and we're gonna go offshore tomorrow. I'm going to make some coconut crusted mutton snapper with some spicy mango salsa for Darren when he gets here. So I'll cook that up in a few hours with that mutton snapper I caught in the last video. So we'll be plenty fueled up to go offshore tomorrow. There's a pretty good little Asian place right here next to West Marine. I have to go to Publix to get all the uh, stuff to make the mutton snapper, but maybe I should grab a little snack first. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that sushi has me feeling good. Well, somehow I lost track of time and it's a little past 5.30 and the Key Largo Fisheries, the place that sells the cheapest bait in Key Largo, I, they're closed, but I called them and they told me I can still come and they'll sell me some chum blocks. Thank God! Those Asian places get me every time. Every time. Oh yeah, here it is, the Key Largo Fisheries. Where bait is plentiful. Okay. I mean, they're closed, but the guy told me to come on in, so I'm gonna take advantage of that. <laughs> Got a big case of this Stars and Stripes chum. Some boxes of thread herring. And a couple smaller boxes of squid.
Ooh, Darren's here. He's at the gate. Gotta let him in. Gonna catch so many fish this weekend. Camera. Looks good though. Looks good though. <laughs> I'm ready. Ready to, to slay it, friend. Mm -hmm. Sexy looking boat though. Hmm. I mean, there's pelicans diving right there. It's kind of windy, eh? Tavernier Creek, so we're going to be heading northeast right out to the Key Largo Humps. If it's too windy out at the Humps, we'll go hatchery fishing. But our goal is to deep drop the Humps and catch a big old, a big old grouper of some sorts. So maybe we can get on some mine, on some tuna, and yeah, that's the plan for today. I hope it stays this glassy all the way out to the humps. One can only pray. <laughs> Please, fish gods. Yes, fish gods, don't let us down. Show us some mercy. Well, pretty windy though. Pretty wavy. Should we put the big boy on the top? Yeah. Sure. I think that'll be good. Turn on the go fish cam. I sure hope we don't lose this thing. All right, it's recording. How's the bottom look? 280? Yeah. All right. All down it goes.
you want to hold on to that while it goes down? I think I might have to turn the boat around to face the other way. There we go. Much better. Hey, it's marking fish down there. Our baits are gone. Yeah, money shot. Come on, money shot. Looks like we're on yeah. something, that's a fish. Dude, I think it just popped off. Something just tugged it real hard and now it's... Really? Yeah, look at... I, I don't know. It looked like something happened. Oh! What? That's a beauty. Yep, yep, yep. Seems like he's... He's, yeah. yeah, he looks good. Seems like he's a little juicy. He's able to stop it, yeah! <laughs> looks good. <laughs> Did it break off? No, no, he's still on. Oh, okay. I just got scared there. He's almost up.
barracuda. A bear. Really? A barracuda. 400 feet down. That's crazy. That's my first time I got a barracuda deep dropping. Dude, look, he broke the other hook off too. Hmm. Grab. Release the beast. There he goes. There we go. Custom, custom weight right there. Oh yeah, it broke right there. God damn it. Drop number four. So far we've hooked up every drop except the last one where some technical difficulties. <laughs> again <laughs> Thank you. 
I see color. No, that's a grouper, I think. Oh, wait, no, what is... Yeah, that's... You on, dog? It's taking line, man. Another one. Ah. Oh. Number two. <laughs> Fuck. Is that all that's down there? What the hell did we catch, man? Looks like we caught someone else's old. Uh... I'm going to take it out of the water. Maybe there's a nice hook attached to it. There's barnacles on here. Looks like someone lost their fishing rig. Wow, look at that. Look at this size hook they were using. Jeez. Oh yeah, it's good. Get, oh quick, before that shark gets it. Yellow eye snapper. Oh yeah, that's a good eating right there. <laughs> My jacket keeps going over the GoPro.
Beautiful. Yep, drop her on down. Well, we pretty much hooked up right there as soon as it hit the bottom. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Ooh. oh, he's taking line. Oh, he's taking that line. Oh, sh oh, 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 he's coming back up. No, he's taking line. <laughs> oh, he's smoking the reel. All right, he's coming up. He's coming up. He just needed to be reminded that he belongs up here with us and not down there. Oh no, he's taking life. Like, I don't think so. He didn't like that. Uh, Holy crap. Don't let the drag go too tight. That sucker will pop. Whew. All right. Boy, this is an emotional roller coaster. <laughs> This could be that Warsaw we've been looking for. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> he is unhappy. Dang. I wonder what he is. I know. Fish on! Does that look like a little tuna she just pulled yeah, on? Yeah, or a little tuna or a little Yeah. All right. Cool. We were the first ones out here at the humps, by the way. <laughs> All these other boats. Slow. Yeah. Wow. Some serious waves, though. Let's realign and drop another one down. Flying fish everywhere. We definitely need to troll a little bit before we leave here. It's only 11, we have so much time. So much time to fish. We're back in the drift. Down she goes. If we catch another AJ, I say we just throw him back. Yeah. We got plenty of meat. Yeah, plenty of meat. That's bottom, right? Yeah. Yeah. Dang. Oh, nice. Look at all that commotion. Yeah, we're gonna put this one back like 150, 150 yards.
go. The planer is working. Is it? Yeah. It's keeping it down. Really good. That's pristine. Well, I mark where it's at so we can come back to it. It looked good, but... Yeah, I say we fish that. Let's bring in the lines. Oh yeah, it looks good. <laughs> looks like it's holding. Oh yeah, that's juicy. That's gonna get a whole bunch. Oh crap. Dang, that whole chum block's already gone. Seriously? Pretty much, yeah. See what you got here. What does it feel like? It's a little snapper. Ooh, snapper sounds good. Maybe yellowtail? Stay tuned. We're almost there. Yeah, what do we got here? A oh, a little black grouper. Well, that's cool. Get it, get it, boy. Oh, little rock kind, I think, or whatever. Red hind. Dang. Now we're talking, man. Yeah, it seems like he's a decent size something. Might be a grouper the way he's like pounding down like that. Moan, let's see what it is. I think it's a nice snap. Yeah. Oh, another black grouper. <laughs> Damn, this guy gave you quite a little run. Oh, he's a pretty one. Oh, grunt. Yeah, grunt. Dang it! So much hype, but then just a grunt.
Lucky him, he gets to go home. Lucky him. He just made like a squeaking sound to me. I hope that's a yellowtail. Oh, another grunt. Oh yeah, a little grouper. Hind. Hmm. We got lots of chum to use here. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, he got off. Woo. Could have been a mutton, maybe. That's what I think it was. Yeah. Making your tater tots, now you don't want them. One for Darren. One for Heiko. Now let's cook up some more. South Florida Fishing Channel. Ooh, it's getting a little soft. Juice is flowing now. Should add in the video that it's a lemon from my garden. Right there. Where's this lemon from? That lemon is from my garden. And it's grown with love. How do you fertilize such a lemon? A little bit of citrus uh, fertilizer. Some of the organic stuff. Yeah, I'm good. Well, I'm... So good. 